Hello, uh, this is the basic demonstration of the basic uh, uh, MVP of a smart funds. Smart fund, it is uh, uh, the combined combination of uh, the group of uh, autonomous contracts and the D apps. Assume that, uh, assume the two uh, two entities, the traders and co-traders. Co-traders are the consumers which will add the funds to the smart fund and the traders will uh, <coughs> follow up with the portfolio uh, proportions and based on which the investment will be done by this autonomous smart fund contract. So currently uh, you can uh, get, a, get an overview onto the uh, particular architecture of the overall uh, MVP app. So here is the smart fund application. So let us in parallel get into the uh, uh, the MVP UI. So let me just fire up the Drupal develop. And let's migrate the contracts. And I already have it to uh, the tiny server development server running so we'll be able to see this applications MVP UI so just get into so here we have uh, recently deployed this particular smartphone contract onto 2C2B and here it is the same and uh, when the contract is being developed we already have the COT being uh, solved over with uh, during the ICO phase or and uh, the uh, the co-traders will be holding the COT in their own account Ethereum accounts so the COT contracts address so let's get into the uh, setting up the accounts for uh, the co-traders and tra trader so I'm setting one Ethereum account for the co-trader and one Ethereum account for the trader for the demonstration purpose. So here you will uh, see that uh, this particular co-trader has the 100 COD in its balance. And uh, so this particular UI is uh, for the COD management. So from here that co-trader can uh, see the uh, see the COD balance. Uh, he or she can approve the uh, uh, set an approval for particular amount to any particular Ethereum address and we can also process the transfer right from here it's, so it will be somewhat similar to the uh, COT wall, uh, the Ethereum wallet and apart from that here the system as, as per the architecture of our system the co-trader will approve uh, the fixed amount of fund for the smartphone contract and the contract on the add to fund call will acquire that particular balance so let's proceed with that so let us first approve on the name of this smartphone contract I'm approving 500 COT so it's approved and here when I uh, fire the transfer to fund, this co-trader will be will transfer this amount of COT onto the smartphone's account, and that amount will be associated with this particular trader. That means that co-trader is approving the investment of this particular, let's say, 50 COT for this trader's portfolio, and. Uh, Oh, with the escrow or the autonomous facility of the smartphone contract so let's proceed with that so here the smartphone balance for this co-trader is 50 the COTs uh, which were 10,000 have been deducted and resulted to 9950 so that 50 COT has been transferred to smartphones holding and with the association we have put on the traders address so the trader will have the smartphone balance of 50 for his portfolio to get invested so let us have one more transaction over here so I'm trans transferring C, uh, 20 COT more to the same trader for the smartphones approval as we 
as we already have the approval for 500 COT we can have up to 500 COT to be added to the fund so now the count is 70 the smart fund COT holding is 70 and the total SF smart fund balance of the trader is 70 and yeah the, as, as for the uh, traders uh, workflow trader can update their portfolio with the different currencies for example one BTC to be 15% uh, LTC to be 20% uh, so these this will go up to the total of 100% that means that total uh, for, for this total 100% of the tradable uh, smart firm this will be the proportions of the uh, investment by the uh, particular traders portfolio so that's the basic overview of the uh, smart fund uh, architecture thank you